You ready for some heat? Yeah, <laughs> I, I like the 70s. This 90s stuff. Well, then enjoy it tomorrow because <laughs> yeah. then we're going to turn up the heat in a big way as we head towards, especially Wednesday and Thursday, and it gets even hotter week from today. There's even some storm chance to tell you about this upcoming week. Tomorrow, though, typical June day, upper 70s. We'll have sun in the morning, some clouds in the afternoon, and then Eric is not going to be happy starting Wednesday at 90 or 89 on Thursday. Thursday also comes in with a chance of thunderstorms scattered in nature. Some of these storms, though, could be on the heavy side. Notice that down towards the uh, northwest. Indiana, south of I-80, and some storms could even be severe, producing damaging winds and even some hail. As you mentioned, a week from today, it gets even hotter, mid-90s in the forecast, approaching record levels as we head into early next week. Out there right now, we are in the 50s in most spots, hanging on the low 60s, Morse and Ottawa, 57 degrees at the loop. It's, look at this, as cool as 46 in Michigan City, and many spots headed into the 40s here for tonight, especially outside of Chicago. In the city, we'll be in the low 50s, but suburbs mid to upper 40s by tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning, Morning featuring sunshine. Notice though will be partly cloudy by mid morning and then turning more mostly cloudy to even overcast by the end of the afternoon. But it'll be milder tomorrow thanks to more of a south and southwest wind. Today stuck in the 60s. Tomorrow, a couple of 80s down here towards the south. Coolest readings will be near the lake shore with 74 degrees as we head towards tomorrow afternoon in the loop. Winnetka and Evanston also at 74, but 77 O'Hare, 78 in Elmhurst, 79 in LaGrange, Bolingbrook at 79, staying though in the low 70s here along the rim of the lake in northwest Indiana. Burns Harbor tomorrow at 73. We'll up the temperatures. We head towards Wednesday at 89. Strong southwest winds allowing for 90s in the western and southwestern suburbs. Only a 20% chance for an afternoon early evening thunderstorm. But then as a front approaches the area, that storm chance goes to 60% on Thursday. It's going to be a very hot, unstable air mass on top of us with still breezy southwest winds. So a lot more 90s on the map on Thursday. And the ingredients are there for severe weather. The severe weather experts in Norman, Oklahoma have high highlighted our entire area already for the potential for severe weather Thursday afternoon, Thursday evening. That's when we think the time frame will be there as the front approaches and high temperatures happen in the low 90s that a few of these thunderstorms could turn severe, producing damage winds and large hail. Also seeing some indications of some heavy rainfall that could maybe allow for a flash flood threat. You see it right there again, mainly to the south of I-80. So Thursday could be a busy weather day, and that's why weather alert is already posted. Behind that front, some cooler air moves in as we head towards the end of the week as we head towards 79 Friday, 80 on Saturday, and then on Sunday, well, looking at those temperatures to get back in the 90s with an isolated storm for Father's Day. 95, though, on Monday with a chance of some storms. We'll keep an eye on next Monday. Ingredients are there for even some strong to severe weather a week from today. All right. Thank you, Albert.